Here with the owners of Western Dreamer standing alongside, we have Pat, Matt, and Daniel Daly. And the other guys told me that Pat was going to do all the talking tonight, so we're going to let you do that. Now, let me ask you a question. When you guys bought the horse back in November of 1996 for $125,000, first of all, did you realize that you were taking a horse off one of the most successful owners and breeders in the sport in George Siegel and his Brittany Farms? And did you ever expect that the horse and you guys would be poised to win the Triple Crown of Pacing? Yeah, we knew who we were buying it off, and that was one of the reasons why we probably thought about this one longer than any other and talked to Bill for a number of weeks about it. Uh, I don't think anyone thinks when they buy a horse that they have the, the potential horse of the Triple Crown. Obviously, you hope that, but I don't think any of us would be honest if we say we thought that for one minute. Now, he lost seven of his first eight starts this year and then came back and, and had a tremendous recovery. What's the reason for that? Yeah, Bill attributes that to, to two things. Uh, first of all, obviously putting Mike Lachance, and when you put the, perhaps the best driver in the game on a horse, that has a, does a lot for the horse. And secondly, he changed the shoes to, to aluminum shoes, and, and Bill thinks that was a big difference as well. So those two factors, we think, did it. And we're taking a look at him now. Scoring down for driver Mike Lachance, and again finishing third in his elimination. Are you a little bit concerned about that? You know, he's won and he's lost this year when having to race twice in one day. For him, the Little Brown Jug was a winner. The Dancer Memorial was a loser. Are you concerned or are you confident? Well, we're always both concerned and confident. I think uh, this big race for us, he raced well, was beaten by a good horse, and we'll see if he's got enough to come back and win it for us. All right, well, look, uh, congratulations, first of all, on all your success. He's made over a million dollars this year, and good luck to you guys in the upcoming final of the Messenger Stakes. And uh, if you win the Pacing Triple Crown tonight, I know you guys will be hooting and hollering over there. So we'll let you go and uh, go watch your horse as he gets ready for the big one. Thank you very much. Okay. All right, we had Pat.